Hi friends and welcome to my NaNoWriMo weekly vlogs. This is week three of NaNoWriMo month. Yeah, it's the first day of the third week, which also is the 15th and that makes halfway between halfway until the end exactly of the month. So it sounds like a pretty momentous day, but it kind of feels like a regular day. So we'll see. I have hit, if you didn't see my last video, or if you need a refresher, I have hit 35,820 words. So my goal for this week is to definitely hit 40, um, which I think is more than doable, but I would love to see 45 this week. And that's almost 10,000 words. Wait, that is 9,280 words. My math, you know, anyways, this week, which if the last two weeks are any indication, it should be fine. I should be doing this and then I'll only have 5,000 words to do in the last week. That would be wild. So anyways, I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's focus on today and get today done. It is an exciting chapter. It's actually one of my favorites when I was planning and outlining. You guys know my main character just went through some shit, okay? bad, devastating, life-altering things, okay? And now something is about to happen again, but it's like... So now we're going back into like kind of a thriller, edgier seat uh, instance, uh, moment, chapter. I don't know how to explain it, but this chapter I've been looking forward to writing this whole time, and it is also like the final straw for my main character. Okay, this is what makes her be like, if you ever contact me again, I will kill you or call the police or something. It is the proverbial straw that broke the camel's back. So I am looking forward to writing this. It's all I'm trying to get at. I don't know why that was so hard to say, but looking forward to it. Yeah, so it's uh, nine o'clock at night and Kai wants a soda. That's not happening. Like I said, it's nine o'clock. I'm about to start writing. I've got to light my candles. I've got the lights going, you know. Anyways, I will update you when I'm done. Let's see what I get done. I don't know. This is a terrible startup. So. Hello, friends, and happy Tuesday. Where do I start? So yesterday, I did not write at all. It's not that I didn't want to, but I got a little wrapped up in a K-drama with Andrew. So I just didn't write. Um, we were up late watching that. And then just now, not just now, the last like two hours, I've been trying to write. <sighs> but I only got 1,240 words. That is not, not ideal. I know I'm ahead schedule and that this is fine. Um, I can catch up. Actually, I don't have to catch up. I can literally just coast along at this and still finish it. But I don't know. I feel like not writer's block, but I'm just not in it tonight, which sucks after taking a night off. So I'm gonna call it. And I guess I'm just gonna hope for a better day tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong. Nothing's wrong, but I just don't know why I'm not feeling motivated right now. I'm not into the story. I don't know, so it is what it is. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna actually go crochet. Uh, I, I, yeah, I think part of it is I have a lot on my mind. Like I'm thinking of to do's that I have and I've got different deadlines for different things. And for some reason tonight, it's just <sighs> give me a little anxiety, but it's fine. We're good. I've got this. I can, I'll do everything. It's fine. Um, but yeah, so that's it for Tuesday. 1240 words, not a lot, but it's more than I did yesterday. So we're still moving in the right direction. Um, but hopefully tomorrow we can do better, right? Well, we, I mean I. Hopefully tomorrow I can do better. We did um, decorate the tree with ornaments today, so that was really fun. The kids loved that. And I did go on my run. I didn't do that yesterday either, but I did yesterday's run today. So I'm gonna do, then I have to do tomorrow's run tomorrow, and then I do get a day off, and then Friday I do another one. That's my update for Tuesday. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and we're hoping for a better day. Uh. 
Hello friends, um, and welcome back. I don't know, it is Saturday currently, the 21st, and I have not updated this vlog in I think three days. Yeah, I think I last updated you Tuesday. Um, so today's the fourth day since I've talked to you. I'm so sorry about that. That's not to say I have not been writing. Uh, let me just let me just catch you up on my week. Okay, so Sunday I wrote 3,200 words. Monday I did not write. I think you guys already knew that. And then Tuesday I only wrote 1240. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I remember updating that. I just didn't, I wasn't in it. Like, I would rather spend my days write, not my whole day, but I'd rather spend time writing words that I'm proud of or that I won't have to go back and just like rework more so than I already have to because obviously this is just a first draft so there's going to be a ton of editing and all that fun stuff but uh so I only did 1200 words that day and then now here's the uh the the naughty naughty part I did not write on Wednesday or Thursday um, I don't really know why I just wasn't feeling inspired to write so I didn't and that is also why I'm so grateful that I'm so far ahead in my goal because even at this rate I can still win nano uh, but I do need to really focus and remember that uh, so I read a quote like I don't know where but I think it was Instagram or something but it's um, motivation isn't always there so you just have to like get up and do just do the thing uh, even if you don't feel motivated so i think i'm going to make myself try to write every day um okay obviously that's a goal of NaNoWriMo but what i'm saying is even on a day like i'm like Ugh, i don't feel like writing like i just don't think i have it in me today well i'm gonna sit down and at least try and if after 15 or 20 minutes i'm still feeling kind of like Ugh, then I won't but I would like to make myself try every day because sometimes you just have to get started and once you're in the flow things are just pouring out of you like that is the best feeling so that is what I'm gonna focus on I guess next week because today's the last day of this writing vlog but um, last night I did write 2426 so 2004 hold on there's a net go away 2,426 words. So I did do that and yeah, I am sitting at 42,749 words and it is the 21st. So I have nine days to write 7,350 words. I have no doubt in my mind that I can do that, at least for nano. Will I complete my entire first draft of this novel? That's probably another I would guess like 30,000 because I skipped like the first four chapters maybe not 30,000 that's actually outrageous probably more like because they've been averaging between three and five thousand per chapter so anywhere from 15 to 20 or 25,000 words on top of nano so will that happen I don't know but it will happen before the end of the year and that was my main resolution for 2020 so i know i can get this done i just had a rough week and actually a lot of people online were saying that the third week is kind of the hardest because you kind of get slumpy you're like the excitement you know the excitement wears off and um yeah so that's where i'm at right now but i'm about to sit down and write even though yes the sun's out i wrote yesterday during the day as well i know it looks weird because i'm always at night um but we're gonna sit and write and I do want to see if I can break 3,000 today and hit the 45,000 words total. I would love that, but again, we'll just see how it goes. If it flows that way, it does. If not, then that's fine. Yeah, I will hit you up when I'm done writing. Hi, uh, it is me still, obviously, okay. Uh, and it's Saturday again, still. <laughs> Uh, it's about 5 30 so I'm gonna get ready to make dinner and stuff but I did want to let you guys know that I finished my writing for the day uh, and let's just talk about it so I ended up 
writing 2,983 words today, which brought my grand total of words for NaNoWriMo at 45,732. So I did hit 45,000 today. I'm very proud of that. And so let's talk about this week. This is the last day of week three. So we only have one week left of NaNoWriMo, okay? So um, my word total this week was only 9,912 words. <sighs> Compared to 19,000 in week two, 16,000 in week one, this is not ideal, but fine I'm only 5,000 away from nano and hopefully like 20,000 at most away from the first draft of this novel being completed and ready to edit in the new year so I'm sorry that this video was probably not that exciting um, you guys got to see me go through a pretty not lazy but sorry my family is playing among us and they're just wild but um, yeah, this week wasn't that great writing wise, but um, I still made progress and progress is better than nothing. Progress over perfection. So that is going to be it for this week. Next week, definitely going to hit the 5,000 that we need for NaNo. Um, will I hit 20,000? Or hopefully, and that's not even a set number. I don't know, of course, what the, la the end number will be for this novel. I'm just guessing because of the way the other chapters have been going around three, sometimes up to 5,000, but worst case, I should only need 20,000 more words. And I did that in week one while skipping a day. So I'm hoping, hoping um, I can do it. We'll see. Regardless, it'll be done in December. December is gonna be crazy. We have Vlogmas. I have to plan out everything for their advent calendars it's gonna be crazy okay the end of the year is always really wild but it's my favorite time so i don't mind anyways that's it for this video and i will see you guys in the next vlog which is the final one for NaNoWriMo so if you're doing NaNoWriMo i hope you're doing great and good luck on a strong finish i'll see you later bye you're the night sky trying to make me see your stars